Hello, thank you for clicking on this video. However, before I let you watch the video, I have a, another announcement to tell you. By now, if you've watched any of my Gmod horror map videos, which there's only two of them, so if you keep up with my channel, it's kinda hard to say you haven't, then you would know who Yakon is. This is either good news to you, I don't care news to you, or absolutely horrible news to you, depending on how much you like my content. But, on Twitch now, I'm going to be streaming every Saturday. In my time zone, it's going to be 4 p.m. to 10 p.m. I don't even know my own time zone, so that doesn't mean anything. I don't know your time zone. So on screen right now, I have just every single time zone laid out with a time. Just find yours, and that's what time I'll be streaming for you. This might not always be with Yakon. Sometimes you'll probably not be available. And on the days that he won't be available, I'll probably be doing something by myself, or maybe I'll have someone else in it. Any days that I'm streaming by myself, it'll probably be the Minecraft map, or world that you're about to watch right after this announcement. So, if you don't watch my streams and you decide to come to another Minecraft video, it may look different, so I would suggest tuning in. Uh, it's probably gonna be nothing but cringe, just a quick warning. Especially my first stream, I don't have really any experience with streaming. I have streamed a couple of times on the same channel on Twitch I'm going to be streaming on, but it's literally just me editing videos, so it's not going to mean anything. Also, probably even worse news, I'm going to be using Facecam, which is something I have not used in approximately, probably about two years. So if you would like to see what that looks like, I don't know why in the hell you would, but if you do, then tune in, I suppose. It's probably going to be awful. It's been two years, so just kind of been sitting on my desk for this time, so might as well use it. Anyway, link in the description to my Twitch channel. Uh, like I said, whatever time zone you're in, go find your time, and that's what time I'll be streaming for you. Click the link in the description. I don't know how any of the features on Twitch work, so I can't say to subscribe or anything, because I don't even know if that costs money or not. It's... I'm pretty sure Twitch is entirely different from YouTube, so... Anyway, if you want to go see that, go see that. If you don't, then... Completely ignore this announcement and enjoy the video. Hello, and welcome to this episode of Minecraft. I am very uh, scared to make this video, I guess I would rather say, because I do not know what's going to happen for me being in the Java edition. That's not what I meant to say. I meant to say the Snapshot edition. Because my one phobia right now of playing on my survival world in the snapshot is that what I do in the survival world, is it going to save? Because I'm in a snapshot. And that's what I don't know. So I'm going to back up and load it. And that's what I'm hoping. I'm, I'm hoping whenever it says back up and load, I, I, what I'm hoping is that it's going to, that means that everything's going to save. But I don't actually know. So, anyway, if you watched the last video I made on this world, Ominous Banner, why is that called that? Why didn't they just call it Pillager Banner? That's a weird name. Anyway, if you watched the last episode of whenever, whenever, <coughs> if you watched the last episode of whenever I was in this world, you would, uh, you would know that I used this thing here, which I can probably close up now. You would, uh, that you would know that I used that to make that by... I don't know, getting a bunch of obsidian. And then you would also know, if you watched the whole way through, why do I have no dirt? Uh, then you would also know that the spawn that I got for the nether was, coincidentally, the worst possible spawn anyone could have ever gotten. Uh, I spawned completely over lava. And... I don't know if I'm going to even have enough stuff to, I don't know, build over to there. But anyway, I'm hoping I do. So I'm going to get a, just all the cobblestone I have, which, where did, I could have sworn I had so much more stuff in my chest. Eh, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to get all the cobblestone I have, and I'm going to make my way over there. I hope to get another right. Uh... Probably won't, actually. I don't even know if Netherite's even in this snapshot yet. If it's not, well, then that's going to be bad. And if it is, well, then cool. Uh, I have seen 
Uh, so far, everything in the Nether update, I've seen all the biomes, uh, the ba uh, the basalt biome and the forest biome and that stuff. I've seen the piglins, the the piglin beast, uh, the striders, which I can see down there. Probably not going to get one of those because they creep me out. I don't like how they look. And as long as a gas doesn't pop up right now, I should be fine to go over here. Well, started off great. Uh, these guys are going to attack me. Yep, I do not want to be here anymore. Uh, now that I'm realizing that that was not supposed to happen. I was not supposed to fall. And I am also not wearing gold. So I'm going to die pretty quickly down here. Uh, for some reason. Every time I play on computer. Like, just play anything on computer. I am probably the worst at it. I'm so used to just playing on controller that I just can't do this. Anyway, I'm here to mainly kill a bunch of Endermen. That's like my main reason to be here. Like that's probably the only reason I even want to be here. It's just to kill a bunch of Endermen so I can get Ender Pearls. Why is he not dying? Why is he taking so many hits to kill? It's an iron sword. It's not that bad. Dude, this is ridiculous. How much health does it have? What? That was an iron sword. That wasn't like a wooden one. All right. Well, I don't know about that. Uh, I feel like that probably should have done a lot more damage, and I probably should not be dead right now as well. So that's kind of stupid. I don't think that was supposed to happen, and I just bonked my uh, microphone. So that probably sounded really wretched to anyone who just heard that. I apologize. Uh, I'm going to make like a golden helmet just so I don't get molested by every single piglin in the, uh, <laughs> in the nether. Because obviously that's bad. I would rather not die, even though it's already happened. So uh, that dream's kind of out the window. Uh, I was So anyway, I'm kind of here for the Enderman. Uh, Endermen, I guess. I'm kind of here to uh, harvest them, uh, uh, chop their balls off, I guess, to get ender pearls. But now I'm kind of regretting it. Now I'm not really sure if I should or not, because they uh, apparently are immune to iron or something. Because I hit that guy at least ten times, and I feel like it should have died. But that's also me, and I'm also a very salty 13-year-old, so. Okay, so that was a failure within my first... At least 10 minutes of being in the nether. I'm already dead once. And that's not good. I need... To find Endermen. I need to kill them. Because no matter what anyone says, he should have died. And there's another fortress, literally right here. Okay, well that's lucky of me. At least I'm getting lucky on one thing. I really want to kill you, but I don't know if it's a good idea. I don't know if I should or not. Oh! I oh, probably should have brought a... Wait, they're not immune to fire? I feel like they should be immune to fire. Okay. Oh, I really should have brought a bow and arrow. Actually, I think I'm going to go do that, actually. I, I knew this block was rare, but... Whoa! Oh, no! Oh, no, crouch! No, 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 no! Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah, well, well, yet again, keyboard and mouse, I'm just so bad at it that I, uh, I kept crouching instead of running. I had to look back down to see what I was doing. Ah, but I'm not going to blame it on the controls. That was my fault. That was my mistake. That I am I am the reason that I am now dead. I'm not even going to go back down to see if any of my stuff is still there. Because I simply do not care. You know, I'm really struggling right now to find a way of making mining interesting. Uh, my inventory is almost entirely full of cobblestone. And blocks that just aren't diamonds. Uh, I haven't found anything. 
Uh, no diamonds at all. Nowhere. None. And I have officially run out of room to put cobblestone. So, that kind of sucks. I don't know how much more stone pickaxes I have. Oh, I'm down to my last. Okay. Well, I guess now I have room to pick up more, uh, more cobblestone. I, uh, do not have very much luck whenever I'm mining for diamonds. Uh, granted, I am also not on Y12 right now. But, if I go to F3... Oh, never mind. I was gonna say that Y12 is like right there, but I guess never mind. Y12 is like six more blocks above that. Or maybe like five or four. I don't even know. You know what? I'm gonna go back to the nether. I'm gonna walk into the nether with nothing. I'm gonna walk in, and I'm gonna... with nothing but an iron sword, and that's it. Oh, and also a golden hat, so I don't get molested by every single piglin that there is. So I'm gonna walk in with nothing but an iron sword, maybe a pickaxe, maybe a bow and arrow, even though I have no feathers or sticks or flint to, uh, to make any arrows. Because I have no arrows. But. I think I'm going to walk in. And I'm going to go exploring. Because this is the snapshot. Which means that the biomes. I uh. Don't know what just happened. Uh, whenever I was saying the word means. My voice. Didn't even crack. It just. Dilapidated. It just died. It just sank in. I was, that, that sounded awful. That was probably the worst thing I think I've ever recorded. But anyway, I'm going to walk in with nothing on me. And I'm just going to go see what biomes I can find. Because if I can manage to find uh, Soul Sand Valley, that would be cool. Or if I can even find a basalt biome, that would be even cooler. Because that is very new, actually. Basalt biomes are very new. Uh, like I don't, I think they're like literally not even that old. Well, I guess nothing in the Nether uh, updates old because it's not even come fully out yet. It's just snapshots. But when I say like not, oh, 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 I can hear lava. I know it's somewhere. I can hear lava bubbling, or bubbling. Oh, this wasn't all for nothing. Oh god, thank god. There's also water, like, directly. Oh, it's a whole cave. Oh, well there's the lava, okay. Huh, maybe I should go explore that cave. Thank god, I seriously thought this was going to be all for nothing. Uh, there's like seven diamonds here. Oh, six. Eh, whatever. It's still, it's still a lot for me. Why can I, where, oh. Man. Diamonds. I mined way too much for just six diamonds. I don't want to be greedy or anything, but I mined an awful lot to just come out with six diamonds but you know what I'm also not mad can I make you eat this can I feed this to you no eat it no please eat it you don't understand how much I want you to eat this there's nothing wrong with it just eat it Look at it. Yeah, there you go. How's it tasting? Come on, man, eat it. Munch on it a little bit. It's a yummy snack just for you. 
You're not leaving this house until you've consumed all of it. Get eaten. Eat it. There you go. Ha! How's it... How's it feel? Huh? Oh. Well, that was unsatisfying. Well, I guess a promise is a promise. You can leave now. I really, really was hoping you would have died for that. Well, I guess poison doesn't kill anything. I guess poison just gets you down to half a heart. Unless you get splashed with it again, so... I guess I wasn't necessarily actually expecting it to die. Uh, unfortunately. Uh, would have been better if it did die. Because, uh... You're really annoying, which is probably the reason I actually let you go. Speaking of, what did you just pick up? Is that bone? Where did you even get that from? Also, why are you not leaving? Is it because I made two other foxes create you? And then I... Nope, never mind, he's gone now. I'm going to sleep under that tree. Okay. Well, at least it's away from me. If you've made it this far into the video right now, I want you to comment in the comment section what new mob you would like to see in another update, just because I'm genuinely curious. I'm not trying to be one of those people that are like, oh, leave a comment down below if you've made it this far, and then keep watching because something crazy's gonna happen. Uh, no, I'm not trying to be like that. I just am genuinely curious of what mob you would want to see, because uh, I know a mob I would want to see. I would want to see a dragon, because that would be cool, and I'm pretty sure, uh, I'm pretty sure I heard something about red dragons, and I think... Somewhere on the Minecraft feedback section, uh, section, someone said something about red dragons, and I think it went under review, I believe. So that would be cool if you could have red dragons. I forget what video it was, but there was one video that I watched of this dude. He was like contemplating cool stuff that, like stuff that could be really cool to have in the new uh, another update. And he talked about like a red a red dragon that just flies around and doesn't attack you unless you attack it, and then whenever you do attack it. Oh, here you are! Well, I guess, I guess that explains you. Anyway, he was talking about a mob. Uh, it was a red dragon that wouldn't attack you unless you attacked it. And whenever you did attack it, it, there would be, it was like a boss fight. And, uh, a bot, like a, what's it called? A health bar, I guess, I would say? I feel like it's called something else, like a boss, boss bar, maybe? That just doesn't sound right, though. Well, anyway, he was talking about, like, like, how that would be cool and all. And I was, like, really on board with that. Like, I thought that sounded really neat. And I don't know why. Like, something about the fact that, uh... Or I guess something about the idea of just, like... A dragon just flying around and not attacking unless you attack it. I just think that sounds really interesting. Because I would want to know how that would pan out. I also, I also would, like... Uh, is that another nether fortress? Why is there another? There's one over there and one right here. I got the unluckiest spawn, but probably like the most perfect seed for the nether. Anyway, I'm not going into that because I don't want to die already. Uh, but anyway, I would really want to know how that would look uh, different from the Ender Dragon. Er, I also I also watched some other video that was called like stuff that Minecraft refuses to add or something. One of which was sharks, and I think I also watched the developers give reason as to why they're not going to add sharks, and it was the most stupid reason ever like it was something about like kids being encouraged to go like attack sharks or something which is just absolutely ridiculous like what child is going to walk up to a shark and just start trying to murder it and they were talking about like how sharks are already in becoming endangered and or maybe they are endangered i don't really know or care and like how like they don't want it to get any worse and it's just the most dumb reason like just like then why have pandas why have ocelots? I don't know if ocelots are... Uh, I don't know. Do I want to make this jump? I really don't, actually. I don't know if ocelots are endangered, but I thought I heard someone say that they are, and I'm just going to go off of that, because I don't actually know. Only time I ever research animals is whenever I'm going to get one. Like, recently I just bought two axolotls, and I researched more about axolotls than I think I've ever researched about an animal in my entire life, mainly because they're so difficult to take care of. Like, the water has to be kept at, like, under 70 degrees and stuff. And they also have to be fed, like, worms. Oh! I don't even see any blazes. Where are their blazes shooting me? Okay, whatever. But yeah, I, I had to research a lot about axolotls, because they're, like, super... 
uh, difficult to take care of. Or they, they're not difficult to take care of, I guess. They just uh, require a lot. Have you ever seen that video from the Dodo? Uh, it was like this old lady who like took care of a wingless bee. You ever, ever seen that video? Because I have. And I thought it was really... I thought it was really cool, actually. Like, imagine being that... I don't know, caring. That you just... Like, take care of a wingless bee. Also, they said something about a wingless bee virus. Or like a... a like, they said that the reason they had, the bee had no wings was because of a virus. And I, I also found that interesting, because I didn't know there was a virus that... Made it so bees lose wings, and I thought that was pretty cool. That, my dog almost knocked me into the lava. That would have sucked. But yeah, I didn't. Uh, I didn't think about that. So, I guess that's kind of cool to know that there's a virus that literally makes it so bees have no wings. Also, I'm pretty sure she said that she took the bees to an like a vet or something. Like, the, like she like wanted to like see why the bee had no wings, and that's how she found out about the virus because she took it to a vet. And I'm just also trying to picture, like, being in a waiting room with that lady and just having her hold a bee there. Because I feel like that would be the most ridiculous thing to ever see. Just having someone holding a bee at, like, an animal clinic. Oh, Yakon's calling me. What could he possibly want? Yakon, what do you need? Yeah. What do you What do you want? I'm, I'm recording a video. I don't have time to see someone screaming into their microphone. Alright, well, uh, what an interesting experience that was. Anyway, I just now realized that there's a... Nether... Uh, nether gold. And there's some basalt right there, too. And there's also some new soul sand. Man, there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Oh! I found the biome, Soul Sand Valley. I, f I found that, which I am hesitant to go into because I heard that that is like home to ghast. Anyway, I'm walking into Soul Sand Valley, which I'm gonna regret. I can already hear ghast, actually. What is that? Is that a coral? I think that might be a coral. Or actually, what is that? No, I'm like curious now. Crimson roots. Alright, well, I didn't know that was a thing. I really... Oh, oh, I forgot. Blue fire. Whenever Minecraft said something about blue fire, I thought that sounded really dumb. But now that I'm, like, seeing... Is someone shooting me? Like, with a bow and arrow? Yeah, whenever... Oh, there is. There's, like, a skeleton. Like, a real, not even withered, normal skeleton. Uh, why? Okay, whatever. Uh, whenever Minecraft, uh, said blue fire, I thought that sounded really dumb, and, like, why? But now that I'm looking at it, that looks really cool, actually. I'm really happy that that exists. Like, I'm impressed by how cool that looks. Why is this skeleton... Why did that take so many hits? Oh, there's some striders. Absolutely hate them. They, uh, look absolutely disgusting, but as much as I hate to admit it, their walking cycles are very... Very intricate and very cool looking. All right, I'm just gonna have to reflect the shots. Let's go. Oh, it made a it made a noise when I got an achievement. That was a nice noise. I liked that. That was that sounded cool. I think this is cobalt here, but I don't know because I broke my pickaxe while trying to get out of this place. Also, this blue fog looks absolutely great, and these bones up here, which I cannot mine due to the fact that my pickaxe has died, uh, these bones, the bones are really, really nice. I really like the bones. Uh, that, it's just the, it's the stupidest touch they could have possibly added to this place, but it made it so much better. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, it's, it's so worthless, and it's so stupid. Like, there's no, like, it's basically hinting that there are, that there used to be giant dinosaurs or something in the nether. Like, it's, like, why would you even add it? But it's, like, perfect at the same time. 
Like, it's like, it's like exactly what this place needed to look even cooler than how it already looks. Alright, here, this looks more natural. Alright, here's the next biome that we found, uh, accidentally. Uh, the Netherwart Forest. Ooh, I wonder. I don't like that. That, ooh. Oh. Oh, that sound. Hmm. I think you have to, like... Uh, you probably have to surround... Uh, I'm not gonna be getting all that. I don't have a pickaxe on me. I should probably still bring this with me, though. Um... I forget what I was talking about already. I lost my turn of focus already again. Alright, this is a very small biome, actually. Or maybe I'm just in a bad part of it. Oh, no, this place is huge. Oh, no, it's not. There's another cobalt biome. I'm surrounded by cobalt biome. Cobalt biome was a really weird biome to add. Like, if you were gonna add anything, why a cobalt biome? It's the weirdest block in the game. Also, I think cobalt is a real material in real life. I don't know what it's used for. All I know is that my science class talks about it, because we're studying the periodic table and stuff, which is the most annoying thing to study whenever you have to memorize, like, 140 uh, different letters and names for a bunch of different materials. <laughs>way one of my dogs died and that's always a plus am i recording okay i am if i would have not have been recording this whole time that would have oh my god that would have been the worst anyway so what did we get done in this episode we got absolutely nothing done we profited none by this episode in fact all this episode did for us was actually make us unprofit we lost all of our uh we lost all of our diamonds but then we made six more but then if you think about it that only makes us profit by one. So basically, we only made one diamond. Farewell. And I'm um, subscribe, comment, like, whatever people tell you to do at the end of the video.